Hey guys, Bonamace36 here. Welcome to another redstone tutorial. Today on a combination lock. And yeah, um, it's you do have to reassess it yourself, though it does work. And if you press the wrong button, you know, it just sort of doesn't work. So yeah, let's go and I'll show you it. So you guys, it's all the way over here. So just kind of annoying okay now it's a little um, sort of rubbish corridor sort of thing is it so just put in the combination though so if you don't get to the door in time you can just press this button and the ah They'll all open again. So then you walk through my rubbish corridor and you come around here and you have to reset it so you just remove these two and put them back here. Yeah, this is the only annoying thing. And if you do press the wrong button, this line will light up and this will push this repeater out of the way which is needed to open the door. So let's have a go at building it. Now it's not really it's kinda messy. If you, I'm not sure why if you, yeah, lava sounds from under here because I tried various traps and stuff, but none of it worked. So now I've just got this. So let's have a go. Come over here. Now I don't, I don't exactly know it, like off my heart. So. I'll probably be going back and forth that quite a while, but whatever. Okay, so you're going to build up a 3x3 three three sort of face thing, but put six buttons on it. Six stone, whatever buttons. Then on the back, you're going to put six torches. Like this, so this one will turn off that torch, etc. So you will have to invert this. Now, now, on the back, you're gonna pull, you're gonna put a line up here. Here. I think, like I said, I've, I've, I pretty much know what, no idea what I'm doing. Okay, like that, and you're gonna go up about three, I guess, and then these will come around here. And then you can invert it at any point. So just bring the redstone around from this torch, like that, that torch will turn off, that's that inverted stone now. Press that button, that turns off, goody goody. Of course this button doesn't turn on or anything, whatever. It links up to this torch up here, not that torch. One, two, three, take it out a few, invert it somewhere. Yeah, there's been lots of lag, I don't know what's going on. I, I've opened and closed things, I've changed things on the game, and I still get the lag, so... Yeah. I can't... I, I have no idea. Really what's going on. But it's just very laggy, that's all. Okay, now... Do this torch here. Out like this. Bit of redstone there. And then this one is like that. Actually, no, no, it's not like that. Block. Hang on. Maybe it is like that. Yep, yep. If you can hear voices outside, my dad's doing something. I don't know what he's doing. I'm trying to get a tennis ball table out of a building. Don't ask me. Okay. Um kind of puzzled. Ah yeah, I think it's like this. Yeah, and one block out, like that, two blocks out, so that's that one. And then Ah, okay. 
put a box there, and then that's that one, and that's them all linked up. Those two, oh, you need to invert this. Right, and of course you got to do these ones, which are pretty simple, but you got to put blocks here so they don't all attach up and stuff. Because you don't, you don't want that. That's not the kiss. And then when you invert these ones at the bottom, you still block here, you know, like usual. And then you'll have to cut it off again around here. Block. Torch. Okay, now they are all connected up. I think it looks a bit... Actually, no, this one. It looks a bit different because I did do something wrong on there. So it kind of looks different. But I fixed it because one of the torches was connecting up to, I think, two buttons or something, so it was going very well. Okay, now, now we've got it. Now this is, this is correct, I think. Yep, six, six torches. Okay. Okay, okay. Now, um, on this one I've got three pistons and so you need to choose which ones you're going to use for your combination so which ones you type in to push the pistons so when one piston pushes then you know next one will the next one will so I'm just going to use this one here this one piston and block and then another piston here in here and a block and then of course this or these as well so I'm going to choose this one into this not you're gonna put it into that now actually if I do press this now if you do press this button first like this then it will push that low. Oh, I don't think it'll work. So yeah, it kind of does push um, this one, but um, that won't work. So it won't be far enough along. It won't be far enough along. Uh, I don't think. <laughs> no, cause if you push this one. If you push this one now, it it won't work basically. You don't need to worry about that. Okay, so now each of these are wired up to the pistons, which will eventually push into which will push here, so the piston will end up here, which will push the block here into between this redstone repeater and this redstone, which will carry the signal through to this redstone to open the door. But you need to get power from the torch to do that. Well, this, this is how I did it. So, over here, I'm just going to push these all forward. So, this one. Okay, so now they're all pushed forward. So, when this. Um, oh, hang on a sec. now when this one pushes it's meant to open the door but of course it won't hang on yeah so what you want it to do is push in between that redstone repeater so you know put a repeater here lock here with a torch on top now this repeater has no power to it because the torch now I guess you could just turn the torch you could just like you know Turn this repeater on, but I don't know. I do it this way. I kind of got this off my clock. Get rid of 64 feathers. Why on earth do I have them in your, my inventory? Okay, so you're going to turn this torch off like this. Pod off. And then this redstone here. See when I power this. So this one. 
that redstone turns on, which will link up to our door, which will be along here. This will probably be a lot tidier because it's my second time doing it. Because this was just messing about. Okay, now. Um, if so, that's basically door. So why don't we still need to put the door in, but we can put that in later. Uh, you need kind of a way that if you do press the wrong button, that it won't open if you're continually pressing these buttons, etc. If you know what I mean. So, uh, we're gonna put a piston here, which will end up next to this piston. If you push the wrong button, this piston will push and get rid of this repeater. So again, when you do come in to so again, once you oh, you can't get it right basically, but then people know. So this might be well that will have to be reset resetted. Okay, so you're gonna put sticky piston here, sandstone there. Good. No. So, the ones we're not using is this one, this one, and this one. So, pull the redstone. Not like that. Okay. So, I'm going to connect all these up because it doesn't matter what they're connecting and stuff. So. Connect all of these up. And this one, of course, uh, I think that'll work. As long as, long as when you press this, that doesn't turn on. Okay. So now this all should be connected up. Like, so yeah. Oh dear, I pressed the wrong button. All three. And okay, so from this you're gonna get some sandstone and pull it around here, and you're gonna drag this. Actually, no, let's not put it there. Let's put it here. We don't have to go around this and stuff. Okay, so now when we press the wrong button, hang on, so it's going wrong. Okay, it's run out of signal. Brief interruption. Okay, now when we press the button, See that piston's pushed out of the way, this thing's pushed out of the way, so now the redstone will never turn on. What the? Okay, there's something under here. Okay, I must have been using it. Okay, then you place this for a Peter lap. Now, you need to, this is the redstone which will open the door, so you need to wire this up. Okay, so just gonna bring the redstone along here into this block and get a door. Okay, doors on, and I'm gonna place a button also on this side. So when you do want to get out, you can just press this. Easy. And now that's going into there. This should work. So let's just reset it. Yay! Okay. Then you just come in. Ta-da! 
And that is it. That is the door combination locky thingy, which doesn't take too much space, so you do have to reset it yourself with a stopper thingy, so you can. So only the right combination works, basically. Which is why it took me so long to figure out and make. Looks a lot neater over here. So one minute to thirty six here, making a stone door locking contraption. Goodbye.